Alright, Halos, welcome back. How's everyone doing? We are back once again. We're doing some more uh, Minecraft dungeons, and it looks like we just need to do one more mission to upgrade uh, any of the, or both of these actually, icon, or, uh, <laughs> sorry, uh, little guys there, whatever you want to call them. Uh, I can't remember the name for a second. Hold on. Artifacts, that's the word. Um, so yeah, let's do one more mission real fast. Uh, we just finished, I believe, Creepy Crypt. Uh, it was quite a big one, actually, but that's fine. Uh, we actually got a pretty good higher level, uh, power level jump there as well, which is pretty good. I think we were like 42 or 45 or something, and now we're all the way to 51, so it's pretty good. Um, so yeah, this should be the next one on the list, basically. Um, I guess Psychic Swamp is the mate, the next real one, I suppose. But either way, uh, we'll get one of these two, and then that'll be good. Um, uh, the cave is the one that gives you that special chest, which is really nice. Um, I might do that one. Uh, but this one we also want to do. We want to go through all these missions probably once again at least once. Uh, and then we can, like, sp if we want specific rewards, we can go for that. So you can kind of tailor what uh, rewards you get back to yourself. Uh, swamp is pretty hard, though. Maybe we'll just do cave for now. Cave can be a little bit difficult as well, but it's not too bad. Uh, I just remember the, the final boss on Soggy Swamp is, or whatever it's called, uh, is, is really really difficult at least uh, probably with like, what I have at least maybe it's not so difficult overall but with what I have currently it's probably not the, not the easiest one but yeah let's uh, let's do some of this guy right here these guys pre-produce into smaller guys oh, I didn't mean to click that that's okay Witches and the creepers especially, because those guys will do a lot of damage if I ignore them. I remember back in the day like speedrunning this little one with a bunch of like uh, little boots of swiftness artifacts and mushrooms. And just kind of skipping over a bunch of the thick bad guys as well. Good times. But yeah, this one has a black chest if you want to call it ender chest maybe um, and it is that gives you like the best rewards basically and it also I think gives you a chance at getting the fighters clubs which is one of my favorite items in this game fighters bindings I guess and there's a unique variant as well which is really good fight a bunch of different guys here so let's go to the first one. Oh, I, I went the wrong way sorry you gotta go up that's right new objective explore the ruins so you gotta basically just survive here uh, for a few different ways because it won't let you go through all right yeah we should be good these guys hurt a lot though Of them, but we haven't finished it yet. There we go. Nice. This should be the last group of guys, and then it should open. Yep, nice. Alright. And then we just do our little puzzle here. I used to have it down really easily, but I don't really remember. Now I just kind of spam click a little bit. <laughs> You'll eventually get it, right? And then we gotta open one more on this side, and then that'll open that area, which is where we need to go. And then we get our ender chest. Let's go ahead and activate this so they can spawn in. Oh, 
the last guy. Nice. Thought there might have been a couple more guys over there, actually. But that works. There we go. Now we get our free ender chest. Alright, let's go grab it real fast. Hopefully we get something good. Get an ember rope and a soul healer. Okay. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the soul healer or anything, but this will increase our power level. So I think I'm going to go ahead and grab it. Uh, ember robe. We already have one of these, actually. And this one has better, way better enchants. Cooldown's really good, and then death barter's really good as well. Um, okay. Let's see. Armor. Where's the other one? Here it is. Ember robe. I'm going to grab these uh, these back then. Uh, you already get f minus 40% artifact uh, cooldown, and this will be... A total, if you total it all up, that's 40 plus 38 is 78%, so by almost 80% cooldown, uh, artifact cooldown reduction there, which is super nice. That's definitely what I'm going to be using for now for a minute. Um, let's go ahead and use some of those enchants as well. And I think I might do one of these as well. Uh, Archer's armor, do I want to keep that? This one's pretty nice. Tumblebee and Deflect are also super nice. In terms of enchants, multi rule and shilling. Also super nice, but yeah, I don't, I don't know. We'll keep them both for now, but yeah. Uh, if I can get more enchantments off of some of these other items. Daggers, what do we have here? Probably get rid of this one. I do like this power bow a lot. It's, it's actually very good. <laughs> I might just get rid of it, though. Because I need a, a higher, a higher leveled bow is the only problem. It's super good. It's what I've been using for a long time. But, um, yeah, I think I'll get rid of it for now. And then this sword, I think I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of, probably. It is super nice, but um, my current guy is, is quite good as well. Having more damage on that shockwave is also going to be really nice. But I want to grab this at least once, and then... Whatever else we have, we'll go ahead and do those. Oh, we still have 10 enchantment levels, so we're good for a bit, actually. Mm, I don't know if that's really worth it. I think costing emeralds is fine. We'll always get more emeralds back. I won't have as many things, though. Overcharge is pretty nice. So the ricochet. I think we'll keep what we have right now, though. Alright, nice. Yeah, that was actually really successful. Leveled up our power level as well, which is good. And then... Our artifacts cool down really quick now, so that's awesome. Oh, you do have to charge it up. Okay, interesting. Interesting. But you still keep the emeralds, right? As long as you don't die. Return to the boat. Alright, and let's get our artifact for returning to the boat as well. You can also go back around uh, the mission if you go down here and fight some more enemies to get some more XP if you need to, but... I'm not so worried about that. This one was really quick though. I might do this one a couple more times, or maybe I'll just do the next mission. Let's go ahead and see what we get though. What artifact, come on. Maybe something good. Totem Regeneration, nice. It's level 60, which is actually really good. Uh, that'll help us level up some of our stuff. Yeah, I'll go ahead and grab that. Is this gonna level bar? No, power level didn't move there, so I'm gonna keep the mushroom. Plus mushroom's super good. And we have our other two th items that we just leveled up. Deathcap mushroom and totem of regeneration. All right, uh, so yeah, obviously I'm gonna get this. And then this doesn't lower our level, right? No, it doesn't. So I might keep both of those for now if it's not gonna like down level or anything. Maybe I'll just keep this now. I'm not sure. We'll have to figure it out. But yeah, um, let's see. So it says it's a 30 second cooldown, and then with all that stuff, let's see, 1,001, 1,002, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So yeah, it's basically 80% cooldown uh, removed, so that's really good. <laughs> It's actually pretty awesome, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, uh, total regeneration we already have, which is, that'll actually increase our power if we do that. But, uh, I do like having the death cap mushrooms. If I keep two, I'll always have mushroom uptime, which is actually really good. We do have that one level less of power, though, is the only thing. Alright, so I think what we'll do is, uh, do I have another mushroom down here at all? 
Let's find it. Artifacts. I think that's the only ones we have. Okay. So let's go ahead and do... Oh, it costs more to do a, a lower level one. Okay. That was a lot less though. Okay, let's do one here. And then for the other item, uh, what should we do? What should we do? So we do these, right? Hold to upgrade. So it returns any invested enchantment points. Let me reread this real fast. Finish an item upgrade. Need to, yep, yep. Item powers revealed based on your current, on your recommended difficulty. Okay. And so it returns any invested enchantment points. Okay. So yeah, I think I'll grab this enchantment point back then. Although I should probably honestly upgrade another artifact. <laughs> um, one of these probably, to be honest. Let's just do this one. Yeah, I'll do this one for now. We can do the other one later if we need to. Alright, cool. That's awesome. So now we have 100% uptime on our... So cool. Okay, awesome. That's what I wanted. 100% uptime on on our uh, <laughs> our freaking thing. Okay, enchant smith. What's this? Modify enchantment. Okay, instantly instantly returns all invested enchantment points on this item. Replaces enchantments of your choice with a random one. The cost increases each uh, time. Okay, for the same item or for, like overall? Because if it's overall, that's kind of crazy. Oh, but it costs gold. Okay. Yeah, I don't have a lot of gold right now. Although I could probably get some more, but right now I, I don't have a lot. So I think we'll kind of skip that for now. All right. Well, let's do another little guy here then. Um, should we just do run back Soggy Cave again real quick? Hmm. We could just do this. 53 to 60, my power is 54. 56, I think I can only get to 55 right now. I think I'll do one more of these and then we'll probably call it, call it a day for that episode. Yeah, let's go, let's go through here again. See if we get, oh shoot, Soggy Cave, is that the one I did? Is that the one I wanted? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, good. <laughs> the uh, the thing looked kind of funny for a second. Yeah, that's great. And then we have the healing as well if we need it. I'm stuck. All right, we're good. All right, no one else over there. Whoops, that's not where I went to move. Meant to go. There we go. Alright, we're good. We're chilling. We actually have a really good setup right now, not gonna lie. It's awesome. Oh, we've got strength as well, that's great. That is actually great. Alright. Like they had the witches this time around. What? Nice. Well, I mean, that's great. I don't mind. There we 
go, perfect. So fast. Alright, that's one down. Let's go ahead and get the other one. Yeah, you can pretty much just farm this this mission. I think it's one of the best ones to farm as well. How much does it burn him for, by the way? What does that say? I can't see it. 18 or something? Okay. Not really what we're looking for, but hey, it's something. It's something. Yeah, it's really good when they don't give you, like, super hard enemies to face either. I really enjoy it when it doesn't. Like the witches, they're, they're not, like, incredibly hard, I guess, but they do a lot of damage. And then you can get trapped sometimes as well, which is... Not great. Alright, let's see. 8,014 and 12. Let's see if we keep our emeralds. I don't actually know. Oh, no, it, it fills up here. Okay, the death barter. Interesting. So do we not keep those in at all? Okay, we got an evocation ro robe. It's just not what we, not better than what we have. So we'll get rid of it. Interesting. Okay. Oh, hold up. It says 8,059 now. So I think we're good. I think we keep it. Nice. Good stuff. I was hoping so. Alright, let's see what we get as our final thing, and then we can wrap up the video here. Put the stats there, let's open it up. What we got? Fishing rod, level 57. I mean, it's not bad. Not bad. I think it'll, it will level up our power level by one, but we could also do the same thing here. So it's kind of like, mm, I don't know about that one, to be honest. I think I'm just gonna keep the death cat mushroom because then we have the 100% uptime of of mushroomized, which is increased attack speed and such, which is really nice, really nice. And that also counts as a mission. So even though it's pretty fast, we can actually get a those upgraded and finished really quick as well. Just really good. All right, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.